What the heck you're doing here today? Today we are shooting the demonstration scene for my guide to three-way sex, two guys and a girl, and I have the very lucky um, opportunity to be with Randy Spears, my very best of all the guys I've ever worked with, and Chris Cannon, one of the other great guys I've ever worked with. And you saw Chris in my guide, How to Dominate a Man, Sensual Domination. So uh, I'm going to have a good old time today. I get to have sex with two really great guys and be directed by my sweetie and have a really great camera person and life is good. So now how many guys do you have? This, I think the, the ones we're doing this shoot are numbers 21 and 22. It's been about nine, eight or nine years since the first one. I, I have to double check when, they, when the Cunnilingus fellatio came out. But I'd say at least eight years ago. So it's been pretty, pretty cool. For some kind of reference and education on sex because it's just people are so uncomfortable talking to their partners about it. It is it's disheartening to, to know that 30 years after the sexual revolution that so changed my life um, and the information that is available for people who want to find it, it's still so difficult for people to talk about their desires, talk about their fears, talk about uh, to, to negotiate activity with their partners. It's like two steps forward, one step back. We haven't, in some areas, we've come a long way. But I think for most people, we're still stuck being scared they're weird or scared that they're considered um, freaky or disgusting and also scared of rejection from their partner for bringing up these kinds of fantasies. So the short answer is I'm sorry that people still need this information, but I'm happy because I'm here to provide it, you know. Um, and my biggest lesson in 20 years in this business is that any motivated person can find their, his or her way to his or her own happy place, for lack of a better word. And uh, I'm glad to be of assistance. Good. Plus I get to work with Randy Spears and Chris Cannon. <laughs> Let me just say, I just worked with Randy two days ago. He, is just, he just never ceases to look brilliant and actually uh, we're looking for a spokesman for Playgirl TV. Oh, it'd be him. Absolutely. It has to be him. It, listen, it's between him, Manuel Ferrar, and Jean Valjean, Jean Valjean, who are both really sexy young guys, but Randy is right there at 42 or whatever. No, Ray, 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 sexy. he's incredibly sexy. Oh, he's, he's a man. The other guys are at night, but they're still they're, they're young men. Randy's an ex, a, a grown man, and he's had been beaten up enough by life. He has compassion and some depth and some gratitude for where he finds himself in the world, and he's incredibly sexy, and that voice. I just, I, I go back with him to the beginning of his career, and I just adore him. I just adore him. He's so sexy.